a website. Oftentimes in games, you have a map, and of course, there are some areas that you don't want the player to see. A common simple trick is used to use is to limit the movement of the camera, the bounds of the camera, so the camera can never reach an area. It is pretty easy to do in Gado, and I'm gonna be showing you that in just two or three minutes. I don't know. So what you do is Control A on the player character, and I'm gonna add a camera 2D since it's 2D. And uh, we got the camera. Then you can go ahead and set zoom three or four, anything you want. Since it's on the player and the child, it's going to be added on the player's position, so it's going to make it more easy to position to the player. Okay, now you can do some extra settings like position smoothing. It's something like uh, the player moves uh, a bit and then the uh, camera starts moving. So I'm going to do it like uh, I like to do it like uh, about 10 pixels, maybe 10 pixels, good. 10 pixels, nice. Now, if you run the game, where well, this is position smoothing, it's just optional. If you don't want that, you can't. Uh, so it's basically like, like uh, the player moves 10 pixels and then the camera starts moving. So it's just like really nice. You can set higher, but uh, I think it's quite enough. Uh, I am going to go and project settings and window. In the window size, I'm going to just set, reset the window size to smaller, uh, just for comfort there. Now, the thing is, uh, you need to know where is the position that you want the camera to stop. So it's pretty easy. You just go to limits and uh, you set a limit for left, right, up, and down. Now, a simple way I do it, add a market to the node. And uh, it's right here. Now, what you do is you go to the place and uh, you just drag it here. For example, this is the limit for the direction which is a uh, right direction so i get the, the since right is x coordinate mean uh, left and right and uh, so i'm just gonna get uh, the position of x and i'm just gonna copy it i'm gonna go to the camera and i'll make sure it's the right side uh, right side uh, you can do it by uh, using your writing hand if you write with the right hand uh, then you could just move it and like I just it's just a simple trick I always use to figure out directions so you, like uh, you can just figure out using your writing hand or if you like write with the left hand you can compare it with that I mean I think you understand so since it's not now in the right direction I'm gonna go ahead and also get the up which is top I want only the camera to reach like right about here like this line so right about here so the player can only go like this point right there so let's get the y since it's up and down y of this marker and uh, you can use any node you can use any kind of node we just need the position just kind of sweet so it's zero on the y for the top and uh, just like that and uh, I can just select the marker and move it to the position I want. Uh, it should be right here. And uh, now let's get the left. If I get the X position, it's going to be the for the left. And uh, go ahead and put it in the left. I only need the bottom now. And I can just move this goes to the bottom and uh, get the y position because it's top and bottom and the y is 736 and put it on the bottom tab and uh, you can check the smooth option i don't know what this exactly do so let's run the game and if your player behaves you know if the camera isn't on your player and it's somewhere else that means you messed up the positioning uh, because the camera no matter what you do doesn't go to the area uh, you can see the player can exit the area so you have to put collisions you know uh, on the corners but it's pretty nice uh, i can just reduce the zoom to three it looks weird and 
Uh, let's turn on smooth. Uh, let's just to see. And if I move the player, you can see our silver shit is still working. And yeah, that tutorial was fun. And okay, so you can see. Yeah, it's a bit smooth to to stop. You can see it's a bit, uh, it's hard to notice, but it's a bit smooth to slow. Uh, I mean, stop. I mean, it starts stopping uh, a bit pixels before, but it looks good. I think you should turn on smooth. It's a little subtle effect, but it looks nice. You can see it like uh, e slowly, you know, trend stop. So yeah, that's just simply it, and. Uh, yeah, that's it for today's video and I'll see you guys in the next one.